Well, as far as aviation adventures go, today is right up there with about as good as it gets. So we're leaving the mining town of Mount Isa. We are flying 306 nautical miles up to Karumba. But before we go, Catherine's been asked to undergo an alcohol and other drugs test. So just waiting for the all clear, and then we are ready to go. We've just left Mount Isa, heading for Karumba. This is gonna be one good day's flying. We're gonna to touch down briefly at Burktown, and we have one good day of flying ahead. Oh, oh, look at that. No way. Yep, don't tell the others, they'll all want one. The mine just on the outskirts of Mount Isa and they've just taken this down halfway to China. That is a really deep hole. Okay, so we've got Burktown. So tell me everything I need to know about it. Okay, so Burktown has an elevation of 21. Very flat. Uh, yes. It is um, run by Berkshire Council. Okay. Burktown is an isolated town located in the Gulf of Carpentaria in far northwestern Queensland. We're going to make a quick stop here to change our camera batteries. As you can see from the footage, we have GoPro cameras attached to the wing, strut and tail of our aircraft. Anything attached to an aircraft must have an engineering order that is approved by CASA. Nothing last minute about this. Our paperwork was organised months before we even left. There it is, the Gulf of Carpentaria has just come into view. Just. <laughs> If you're coming anywhere near the Gulf of Carpentaria, you have to check out Karumba. Crocs, crabs, barra, it's got it all here. But it is a sleepy town, so it's not to trick you into complacency when you're coming into the airstrip. There's a fair bit of air traffic. You've got your mining charter flights, your fly-in, your fly-outs. You've also got your heli joy flights as well in the area. The other thing about Karumba is that this place is frequented by one third of Australia's water birds. So there's a high possibility of bird strike when you are coming in here. So you need to be on your game, but definitely worth coming to check out Karumba. Karumba is located in the Gulf of Carpentaria. It's where the outback meets the sea, and it's the only town along the Gulf of Carpentaria that's inside the Gulf itself. The town's economy revolves largely around fishing and the Century Zinc Mine. In the late 30s, the town was a refuelling and maintenance stop for the Empire flying boats of the Qantas Empire Airways. The Gulf of Carpentaria is also host to the Morning Glory. It's a roll cloud. It's a season event that happens between September and October. The clouds move in from the Gulf around sunrise at approximately 60 kilometers per hour. As the roll cloud moves through the atmosphere, the air in front of the cloud is pushed up and over the cloud. It's becoming a bucket list for glider pilots who saw at pretty significant heights around, above and in front of this amazing cloud. In fact, it's becoming a draw card for any pilot who just want to see this natural occurrence with their very own eyes. 